Supporters of the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter B, are really doing very great things. They are surprising people, pulling up surprises here and there. And people are still saying that uh, they are only on the social media, on Facebook, on Twitter, on TikTok, on Instagram and the rest of it. But what is translating on the ground has become a big worry for the big political parties. This time we mean the PDP and APC. The obedience are not really giving up. They are spreading like wildfire and they are showing real human beings in body and flesh and spirit and no more only on the social media. And the po other political parties are deeply worried. Before we give you the latest exploit of disobedience, we ask you kindly please to like this video, to share it among your friends and contacts, and subscribe to our channel if you are coming across us for the first time, because we always bring hot, juicy, compelling content, and we always also give deep analysis of what is going on. If you're a returning subscriber, we do appreciate you and thank you for always coming to watch our videos. Now, the supporters of the Labour Party presidential candidate P2B, they shut down bringing KB in KB State as they can vast support to strengthen the OB that ticket in the state. The event held at uh, Kamba Hall with a huge number of obedience across the tribe and religion, and was attended by the National Secretary of the Labour Party, Omar Ibrahim. Officials of Nigeria Labour Congress, NLC, KB Chapter, movements for OB and other Labour Party candidates, among others. According to the chairman of KB Nigeria Labour Congress Chapter, Omar Haliru, who was the chief host. Labour Party has come to rescue Nigerians from its current sorry state, adding that the party belongs to Nigeria Labour Congress and knows no religion or tribe. So the LPA scribe Ibrahim expressed satisfaction over the turnout in support of the Ubidati presidential bid. He said Peter Obi, when elected, will stabilize the country ensure responsible government devoid of nepotism and fix the economy and security situation as well as other sectors in the country. The Labour Party will take the lion's share of the country's 89 million votes, he boasted, adding, we need a country where every citizen will sleep peacefully, where every child will go to school. Right, the... Labour Party, one, really has to give it to them that they are becoming more visible on the streets of Nigeria. Could you imagine in KB State, somebody coming out in the street to campaign for Peter Obi, who is all the way from Anambra State, far away. And um, it is not only in KB State, it's happening in Nasarawa, in uh, Adamawa State, in Jigawa State, in various parts of Nigeria. The youths have finally risen, and this is tormenting the PDP and APC. And they are running helter-skelter, thinking of a good strategy to, uh, I mean, to subdue this uh, OB uh, phenomenon that is sweeping across the country. Pito B has been described as a phenomenon himself by many pundits. Be you in any party, you must agree to this. But some, because we are playing politics, will not um, easily give in and admit that they are making him part. But for we observers who are apolitical, we don't belong to any party, we don't do any politics, what we are seeing is no more a social media phenomenon. The youths, especially, have risen in support of this OB. They are the movement. They are the obedience. P2B is just their candidate. The thing is becoming bigger than him. 
That is basically the truth. And um, in Kaduna State also, the Christian Association of Nigeria, that chapter, Kaduna chapter has said that Christians have not concluded on whom to vote for in the 2023 presidential election, but have concluded on whom not to vote for in order not to divide the nation. The chairman, Reverend John Hayab, disclosed this on Sunday evening, you know. So they are saying, we won't tell you who to vote for. <laughs> but you know what? We know those we are not going to vote for. And if you translate it literally, uh, without missing words, the uh, Christian Association of Nigeria is never ever going to support the candidacy of Bola Ahmed Tinubu because it is a Muslim Muslim ticket and the Christians feel that they have been rejected, they have been kicked in the face, nobody recognizes them and they just see them as, uh, yeah, um, just a number. So they're saying, we know who to vote for and we will not tell you, but we also know who we will not vote for. So P2B is breaking grounds with his supporters. One million man rally in the north just took place in many states. People trooped out in the streets and chanting Obi's name as the candidate they will support. So that is what happened in KB State. And we felt that we must let you know that this thing happened. That's all we will take on this. And we ask you, please, go to the comment section and tell us your opinion. We ask you also to like this video, to share it, and to subscribe to our channel. See you in our next video.